Wicked, I is here with none other than my main man James Furman. He is the geezer that signed his name under the films. Now why do we have censorship? Well strangely enough most people in this country think there should be some kind of regulation of the media. I, you must have seen some real dodgy things in your time. <laughs> right? Yeah, a few dodgy things, yes. Must be the best job in the world though. <laughs> <laughs> Just watching porn yeah, all day. I know. Yeah. <laughs> well you think you'd enjoy it but you, you don't. But you've seen 25 years of it. Yeah. I mean, nobody can, you know, well, keep it hard for that long. Yeah. <laughs> that's, not, that's not the test I would apply. Can you not say that a lot of porn is educational? No, sex education is educational. No, but a I lot mean, of me learned a lot of me stuff from, you know, backdoor matrons or whatever. You know, a lot of me tricks came out of that. You learn how to be with a lady, how to romance a lady? Well, I think we try to. There, there's now some very good sex education on video. It is important for kids to know what's going on down there yeah. so they don't make a mistake yeah, and I go agree. up the wrong I, I, I agree totally. <laughs> what films have been banned? Very few films that you've heard of have been banned. So why did they ban Chocolate Orange? <laughs> <laughs> Whatever. Whatever. Yeah. Uh, well, nobody banned that except Stanley Kubrick, who made it. Do you not think that the category 18 is too vague? Should you not have a category that guarantees you muff? <laughs> okay, you, you do have consumer advice now. Uh, if you buy a video, you'll see on it exactly what it contains. So why do they not have that for the films as they well? It, this they, as swearing. They have it. This they will have it definitely now. have They have it now in films as well, but it's optional. <laughs> What swear words make an 18? Well, 18, it's the sexual expletives. Uh, um, but So uh, is flange an 18 or 15? I don't know what flange means. So that, well, that is a word for the punani. So in other words, that punani can get... Means. Well, that is what I'm saying. Okay, you're coming so up with a lot of words I've never heard before. So there's a whole load of terms that mean the same thing as, you know, yeah. what we're saying, the twat or whatever, <laughs> and they can slip in to a PG, I if you don't can. know. If we don't, if we don't understand the word. So do you not need through. somebody who's more street, who knows the terms on the street, to know, I, oh, wait a minute, they said minge, me know that they are talking about the pity. Yeah. So what about the word vagina? Does that make it an 18? No, no. But that is the most dirty word. It's a part that of is, anatomy. No, but I make it sound horrible. <laughs> yeah, I don't think most people would think that. For real, so what that could get into a 15 film. Yeah, it could get into a 12 film. But that, so they can hear the word, the vagina. <laughs> it depends on <laughs> how, how it's said, but I think you could say We want to uh, check out your vagina, however, <laughs> you can say that. Well, if they call them the C word, which is the same thing. Aye, right, for real. But the C word is better than the V word. <laughs> yeah, I don't think so. The C so word is much no. nicer. If you call a girl, say you've got a nice C, you know, that's much nicer than saying you've got a nice V. You, you may think so. I think most women find the C word very, very uh, objectionable. Yeah, only women who is a bit, you know, up their own <laughs> seat. Thank you very much, yeah, Mr. Okay. Fair. Okay. Big up yourself. Do you want to big up anyone out there? Any directors, give a shout out or something mm -hmm. like that? No, just keep up the good work. Okay, wicked. Thanks a lot.